allowing parents on your own personal social media? Yes, no? Do you agree with it? Well, that's what I was asked at reunion a couple of weeks ago. A scout leader came up to me and said, Mark, you're on social media all the time. Do you allow your scout parents onto your personal pages? Well, here's my thoughts. Let's have a brew first. Scout leaders feel, isn't it? So do I allow the parents um, who send their children to my scout group onto my personal Facebook page? No. My Facebook page is my own personal stuff. Uh, I put pictures of my family and, and events and stuff like that. Um, and if they want to follow me, they can follow me on Big Man of the Woods or they follow my um, scout group page that we have. Instagram is a bit different. I don't have a kind of personal Instagram page. I just have a Big Man of the Woods page. So I don't put family photos and events and um, holiday snaps and that kind of stuff. Um, there's nothing in POR that says that you can't allow um, parents onto your social media page. That's up to you. You know, if they want to follow you on Twitter whatever that's it's up to you what you put online isn't it but remember you're representing the scout association your scout group your district and county so if you allow those parents onto your facebook page and there's pictures of you not drinking tea but drinking beer and that's the perception you're giving out on online isn't it remember those parents are going to see you and there's all those videos of you getting drunk and being silly and skinny dipping in a fountain i don't know what you get up to and they're going to actually Maybe it's not right for my kids to be sent to scouts because that's what the leader gets up to. It's in your own personal time. I get that and what you do. Um, but my feeling, my personal feeling is I don't allow any of the parents unless I really know them. Um, I have ma I've made friends with parents over the years um, and we've gone out for meals and stuff like that and they become actually family friends. That's different. But if my, you know, PL parents add me on Facebook, I don't know them, I have no connection with them, I just decline them and then send them to my Scout Group Facebook page. Um, it's just easier, isn't it, you know? Uh, and just like followers of Big Man in the Woods, I don't allow them to follow my personal page. If I've never met you, if I don't know you, it's that kind of thing as well, isn't it? You know, I've, I've got my own safety, I've got my, my family safety, more importantly, you know? It's just about being wise online isn't it you know you're not gonna um meet a stranger down the road and give them your house keys or whatever and say yeah let, let you in i'm going on holiday it's fine it's about just being safe online isn't it and that's kind of one of the points and secondly yeah as i said earlier it's about that perception and what people perceive you as if you're just getting drunk antics i'm using that as an example do you know what i mean i'm just saying for me i keep my personal space separate to my scouting and big man in the woods that's all different so to answer your question do i allow scout parents to add me on facebook as a friend simple answer is no but that's not the concrete answer do you know what I mean gilwell doesn't say anything about that i think it's just about you being safe online and being wise there you go if you've got any more questions uh fire away drop me an email comment below and i'll answer them next time here on Big Man of Woods. Watch this playlist here. It's more advice on first-time scout leaders. See you next time here on Big Man of Woods. Bye-bye.